Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have gone anywhere, but you came to my channel. For that, I'm always grateful. Thank you so much. I'm going to do a Libra love prediction reading for May 20th through May 26th. Please keep in mind, this is a general read. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Don't try to make it your story. Just take what you can from it and leave the rest. In addition, please know the energy can go either way. It can be your energy, your significant other's energy, or someone else's in your love space. Please keep that in mind as you watch and as you listen. If you enjoy my reading or if my reading resonates with you, please give me a subscription or a like. I'd be most humbled. I'm always honored and very grateful if you decide to give me a subscription or a like. Thank you in advance if you do. Let's see what's going on with my peaceful, loving, fun, kind, sweet Libras. Show me spirit guides. What's going on my Libras? Let's see Libras. What you got going on? Show me spirit, guys. Page of Cups. Wheel of Fortune. Four of Wands. The Hermit. And the Ace of Swords. Wow. First of all, Libra. Yes, he's younger than you. He's different than you too. But he wants to give you love. He he is definitely all about giving you love. You know, you've asked the universe for someone and you never it never comes like you think it's going to come. You asked for it, you've manifested this person, and here he is. He showed up. He's offering you love, but he's younger. He may even be a different ethnicity. I don't know. It's something different possibly about him. But I know he's younger than you. And you're, you're older than him. Now, when I say older, I'm, it, it doesn't have to be a lot older. But I mean, maybe five to seven years possibly. Five to seven is just what I keep saying. Five to seven. But guess what? He loves you. You fall in love and he's falling in love with you. And he's trying to offer this love to you. Look at him. He's trying to offer you this cup of love, saying, I am your person. The Wheel of Fortune is here, which to me is, is a really big, big deal. And it's next to the Four of Wands. This is your significant other. Whomever he is, whether he's young or not, it doesn't matter because he might be young, but he has an old soul. And when I say that, you know what I'm saying. He thinks like a, a grown-up adult. He's, he does adult things. He knows how to do adult teen and the will of fortune is here. That means it's goodness here. That means this young person, this young man that's younger than you, that at first you weren't even going to give a chance to, he's your person. He's your person. I see the four of wands in the middle of the reading. Oh, that four of wands is pretty powerful. Four of wands can also mean a soulmate. Um, but four of wands is all about a contract, marriage, moving toward marriage. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah. He definitely sees you as his possible partner. But here you are. Now, I'm going to be very honest with you, Libra. That, that, that uh, Hermit card represents a Virgo sun sign. But the Hermit card also represents someone that is going within themselves. Someone that's, that's trying to find wisdom and knowledge as to what to do with this because you're afraid. And I understand when I say you're afraid, you're, you're afraid because you love this man. You love him, but he's younger than you. You're afraid of it all. But like I said to you, the truth card is here, the Ace of Swords. You're going within yourself trying to find the truth, but the truth is right in front of you. You can smack in your face, but you're afraid to accept this. Accept it because this is the truth. He's younger than you, but he's your man. He's your dude. He's your plus one. And I, I venture to say he could be your plus one forever. He could be your plus one forever. He's ready. Give me three to five minutes. Let me clarify the reading. I just want to clarify to see if I can get any additional information. Sit back, relax, and let me just clarify. Let me see what additional information the Spirit Guys want you to know. Show me, Spirit Guys. Why is the Page of Cups here? Why is the Page of Cups here? Show me, Spirit Guys. Three of Wands. I told you, future, traveling, having a good time. You see, he sees a future with you. He absolutely, you are not just a drive-by. You are not just, he sees a future with you. 
Absolutely, he is your future. I told you that three of wands is future. He is your future. He's younger. He may be even a different ethnicity. It may be something different. I don't know what it is. One thing I do know that he is, he could be younger than you though. But it doesn't matter because he sees a future with you. Absolutely. Let's see why this Wheel of Fortune is here. Show me, Spirit, guys. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? Show me. Oh, what a... Oh, Spirit, guys. Spirit, guys. Spirit, guys. Look at that. This is relationship was destined to be. This Wheel of Fortune has come out again. I've never had this in a read. The Wheel of Fortune and the Wheel of Fortune again. Matter of fact, with this deck, I don't think I've ever pulled the Wheel of Fortune card. This is your guy. This is your man. This is your dude. This is this is it. This is it. What you asked for, you have received. This relationship was destined to be. Younger than you, different ethnicity. I don't know. He's different than you. It does not. Maybe you're white collar. Maybe he's blue collar. I don't know. Maybe you're blue collar. He's white collar. I don't know. But he is your guy. All I can say is this is it. He's it. So let's see why the four of wands is here. Show me spirit guys. Thank you, Spirit Guys. Whomever I'm reading for, if the two cards came out together, that means I'm telling you exactly what the Spirit Guys want you to know. So let's see. Why is it Four of Wands here? Show me, Spirit Guys. Nine of Wands. Yeah, Nine of Wands. I told you, this is your God. Nine of Wands also means not giving up. It means absolutely not giving up. Persistent, not giving up. And he did not give up. He didn't care. No matter how many times you told him no, he didn't care. He knew he wanted to marry you. You're at this point now. You either have to say yes or no. That's where you are because he wants to marry you. I strongly believe this and I think you will be married. Let's see. Why is the hermit card here? But that nine of wands lets me know he's been persistent. He's insistent. You know, one of the big things that for me, um, consistency is a big thing. He's been consistent with you. Consistency is big for any woman. If you really, Because you want to know, is he going to be there when the times get hard? Yes, he is. Is he going to be there to take care of you in case you get sick? Yes, he is. He's been consistent with you. So let's see why the hermit card is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the hermit card here? Five of wands. Yeah, you got conflict going on. Absolutely, you got conflict because he wants to marry. He wants to marry you. Absolutely, he wants to marry you. And there's conflict that's going on here. Conflict. The hermit card is here, though. The hermit card is like you're looking within yourself. You know, you're looking. You you've been in a dark night of the soul because you know you've been having conflict with him because he's he wants you to to he wants to marry you and you're afraid. You put your guard up, especially if it's the Virgo card is here. You're very guarded about this. You fight about this because you're guarded about this. But it's the real deal, and he's for real about it, and he did not give up, and he will not give up. So let's see why this Ace of Swords is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Eight of Wands. Yep, that's what I'm talking about. You're not playing now, right? Yeah, because Eight of Wands means rapid movement. You're not going. You're no longer playing this game. Hey, you're letting them know. Okay, the Eight of Wands is rapid. The truth is coming through. The Ace over the Ace of Swords. Your clarity has come through. That Eight of Wands is. It swiftly came through. When you saw his consistency, when you saw no matter what you did, he wasn't moving away from you, even though he was young and maybe a different, different ethnicity. It doesn't matter. Love is love. Love is love. Let's start at the very beginning of Page of Cups. Someone that's younger than you, maybe a different ethnicity. He sees a future with you with his three of wands. Will of fortune and will of fortune. That just tells a story beyond anything else. Beyond anything else. This is a destined relationship. The universe has shined on it. It's the real deal. Absolutely, he may be younger. It doesn't matter. He's an old soul. Then you got the four of wands here, which means you see him. It's so deep. It could be a soulmate. But when I see the four of wands here too, four of wands is marriage, commitment. He wants to be, he wants to marry you. And you know what? He wants to marry you and he's consistent. What can you say? He's consistent. He, he will not, he's, he, he's, he pushes no matter how many times too that you have told this man no. He he will not take no for an answer. He knows what he wants. He goes after, he's consistent, insistent, persistent. You know, he never gives up. He's never given up on you. And here you are, Here I, I see this, not that it's you per se, but this energy that you have, this hermit card. 
Yeah, you, you pushed him away. You guard, you put your guard back up. And so it caused conflicts and fights because he's like, woman, I, want, I see this literally somebody telling me, woman, what's the problem? You got a problem because of his age probably or ethnicity. I don't know. There's some problems here on you. You've got to go in and find the wisdom because this is a good man. This is, he may be younger. All of those things, it doesn't matter. He's consistent, insistent, and he's and he's and he wants you. Here I see the Ace of Swords here at the last card, which is about um the Ace of Swords is about absolutely truth. It's about clarity. The Ace of Swords is about clarity. You're clear now because you've gone within and you've you've taken the time to pick yourself apart. You've gone within and then you see the Eight of Wands is there. You know, and the Eight of Wands is about um, rapid clarity. In other words, you see now. You see the fact that he's consistent. You, you see the fact that he didn't walk away from you no matter what you did. You see that now. Because the Eight of Wands means you quickly came to a conclusion. And now you're ready. You've come to a conclusion and now you're ready. Because now you see him. You see him and you see this relationship and you see how he moves and you see how he wants you and he loves you. So let's see. Let's see what my oracles have to say. Show me, spirit guides. What do my oracles have to say about this relationship? Show me, spirit guides. What do my oracles have to say about this relationship? Let's see. Well, I want to pull this card because I think this really goes to this. Compromise. Compromise. Yeah, he might not have... He might not be your age. He might be younger than you. He might be a different ethnicity. He might, I don't know. He might be, I, I, I don't know what it is. He might be white collar and you might be blue collar. He might be blue collar and you might be white collar. It doesn't matter. Love is love. Love is love. Love is love. Absolutely. Love is love. And let's see what else will my card say. Oh, well, this is so true. It says, it's up to you. It's up to you. It's up to you and it says trust. Trust. Trust that this relationship, this is it. Yeah, he wants to be with you and he wants to marry you. Trust. You have to trust. And I think that's really hard. You know, this, 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 these cards are talking. You know, I get this card. It comes out every time, but I'm going to pull it. Meditation brings answers. Whatever you do, pray, meditate, ask the universe, and you've already done it. Because you've got your answer. You've got your answer. Huh. Also... It says success, success, success. This will be, it's successful because you got the will of fortune, will of fortune. It's already successful. You just need to accept the success. Last card, I'm pulling a year from now. And I think you guys will be married a year from now. That's what I think. That's what I have for you for your love prediction.